hi everyone welcome back to my channel so in this tutorial we'll be working on this beautiful and very pretty knitting stitch pattern you can use this pattern in your baby sweater cardigan and also you can knit this in your ladies sweater and cardigan this is the way it looks like see this is the pattern wrong side looks like this so this is only four sorry 12 rows repeat pattern and you need to cast in multiples of four and plus three extra stitches and plus two add stitches multiples of four and plus three extra stitches and plus two add stitches so let's begin so for the demonstration i have 17 stitches on my needle which is um 4 plus 4 plus 4 3 times 4 13 and plus 3 extra stitches sorry 12 4 plus 4 plus 4 3 times 4 12 and plus uh, 3 extra stitches 15 and plus 2 add stitches 17 and now we're going to start before we start the pattern actual pattern before we start the actual pattern we're going to need one base row and you're gonna knit this base row only one time for this entire pattern you're gonna knit this row this base row only this time so this is going to be our right side and the pattern starts from the wrong side from this side so this is going to be our first base row so we have only one base row so for the base row you need the first stitch this is your edge stitch and then purl one and start the repeat from here for repeat pattern we're gonna make five stitches in one in this stitch we're gonna make five stitches with knit and purl stitches so knit one yarn in front purl two yarn in back knit sorry, knit three yarn in front purl four and one more knit stitch and in back knit five so we have made five stitches here one two three one two three four five and then purl three one two three that's the repeat pattern from here to here for repeat pattern we have done make five stitches in one and purl three this is the repeat pattern and you're going to repeat this repeat pattern for however many repeat stitches we have you have we have two more repeats here so i'm going to repeat that two more times again repeat that again make five stitches in one knit one purl two knit three purl four knit five and then purl three one two three we have one more repeat knit make five in one knit one two three four and five and then purl three one two three so we have done here three repeats one two and three and after you finish your repeat if you have more repeats you repeat that first and after you finish your repeat at last you have three stitches left on your left hand needle with your edge stitch this is your edge stitch now for these three stitches you make one sorry make five stitches in one one two three four and five and purl one and knit one this is your edge stitch knit your last edge stitch on the right side so we have finished our base row 
and now we're going to start this axial current from here after this base row you're going to need this base row only this time for this entire pattern and now we're going to start the axial pattern so for row one wrong side this is our wrong side row one wrong side slip the first is first edge stage and then knit one and start the repeat from here for repeat pattern you prowl five prowl these five stitches one two three four five and knit three one two three that's the repeat pattern prowl five two two four five and knit three repeat that again prowl five one two three four five and knit three one two three last repeat prowl five one two three four five and knit three one two three so we have finished all the repeats and at last after we finish the repeats at last you will have a uh, five plus two seven stitches left hand and left hand needle now for these seven stitches you prowl five one two three four five knit one and prowl your last add stitch we have finished our row one row two slip your edge stitch and then prowl one and start the repeat from here for repeat pattern you need five one two three four five and prowl three one two three that's the repeat pattern need five and prowl three repeat that again need five one two three four five and prowl three one two three one more repeat knit five one two three four five prowl three one two three and for the last seven stitches two four six seven stitches knit five one two three four five prowl one and knit your last edge stitch row three for row three you're gonna need edge row one slip the first edge stitch and then start sorry knit one and start the repeat from here for repeat pattern you prowl five and knit three prowl five one two three four five knit three one two three that's the repeat pattern prowl five and knit three again prowl five one two three four five and knit three one two three last repeat prowl five one two three four five and knit three one two three and for the last uh, seven stitches two four six seven stitches prowl five one two 
three, four, five. Knit one and for the last add stitch. Row four. Slip your edge stitch and then purl one and start the repeat from here for repeat pattern you are gonna slip you're gonna do yes yes k you're gonna slip the first stitch like so you're gonna flip this stitch like so and then you knit these two stitches together through the back loop and then knit one knit two together and purl three one two three that's the repeat pattern purl sorry from here to here flip the first stitch and knit the knit two together and then knit one and knit two together and purl three again flip the first stitch like so and knit these two stitches together through the back loop and knit one knit two together and purl three one two three last repeat flip the first stitch and knit these two stitches together through the back loop and knit one knit two together purl three one two three and for your last seven stitches flip the first stitch knit these two stitches together through the back loop knit one and knit two together and for the last two stitches purl one and knit one knit your last edge stitch row four sorry row five slip the first stitch and then knit one and start the repeat for repeat pattern you purl three and knit three one two three and knit three one two three that's the repeat pattern purl three and knit three again purl three one two three and knit three one two three last repeat purl three one two three knit three one two three and for the last five stitches two four five stitches purl three two three and knit one for your last edge stitch row six slip your edge stitch and then purl one and start the repeat from here for repeat pattern you're gonna flip this we're gonna do yes k to p yes k to p means you slip this stitch as if to knit like so and then knit two together and pass the slip stitch over knit two together that's the sk2p and then purl one and here we're going to make five stitches in one now we're going to make this make this part here into this stitch so we're going to make five stitches in one here one two three four and five and purl one that's the repeat pattern from here to here yes k to p purl one make three make five in one and purl one again repeat that again yes k to p slip knit wise knit two together pass the slip stitch over knit two together and then purl one make five in one one two three 
four, five, and twelve. One last repeat. Yask to be slip, knit two together, pass the slip stitch over, and then purl one, make five in one, one, two, three, four, five, and purl one. So we have finished our all the ribs and after you finish your all the ribs for your last five stitches slip the first stitch sk 2 p and pass the slip stitch over and then purl one and knit one row seven slip your eye stitch and then start sorry and then knit three one you need this stitch here two three that's the repeat sorry first, I will repeat from here after these four stitches after slip one and knit three so for repeat pattern you pull five one two three four five and knit three one two three that's the repeat pattern from here to here for repeat pattern we have done purl five and knit three again purl five one two three four five and knit three one two three last repeat purl five one two three four five and knit three one two three and for the last edge stitch purl one row eight Slip your first edge stitch and then purl three. One, two, three. Start the repeat from here. For repeat pattern, you need five. One, two, three, four, five, and purl three. One, two, three. That's the repeat pattern knit five and purl three after these four stitches right so again knit five one two three four five purl three one two three last repeat knit five one two three four five purl three one two three and for the last edge stitch knit row nine for row nine we're gonna knit edge row seven slip the first edge stitch and then knit three one two three and start the repeat from here for repeat pattern purl five one two three four five and knit three one two three repeat that again purl five one two three four five knit three one two three last repeat purl five one two three four five knit three one two three and for 
probably last edge stitch row 10 for row 10 slip your first edge stitch and then pro 3 1 2 3 start the repeat from here for repeat pattern you flip the first stitch like so and you need these two stitches together through the back loop knit one and knit two together and then pro all three one two three that's the repeat pattern these three stitches and these three stitches repeat that again Slip, flip the first stitch and knit these two stitches together through the back loop knit one knit two together and pro all three one two three last repeat flip the first stitch knit two together knit these two stitches together through the back loop knit one knit two together and pro all three one two three and knit your last as stitch row 11 slip the first as stitch and then knit three one two three start the repeat from here for repeat pattern you pro all three one two three and knit three one two three that's the repeat pattern pro all three and knit three again pro all three one two three knit three one two three last repeat pro all three one two three knit three one two three and your last edge stitch pro all one row 12 last row slip your edge stitch and then pro all one and you start the repeat from here for repeat pattern we're gonna make five stitches in one one two three four five and then pro all three sorry pro all one and slip the first stitch we're gonna do yes to be here slip the first stitch as if to knit and then knit two together and pass the slip stitch over your knit two together and then pro all one that's the repeat pattern for repeat from here to here for repeat pattern we have done make five in one pro all one yes k two p and pro all one repeat that again make five in one one two three four and five and pro all one yes k to p slip knit one and pass the slips knit two together and pass the slip stitch over your knit two together and pro all one last repeat make five in one one two three four and five pro all one and yes k to p slip knit together pass the slip stitch over and pro all one so we have finished our all repeats and after you finish your all repeats for the last three stitches make five in one one 
two, three, four, five, and then roll one and knit one. So we have finished our last row, row 12. This is one repeat. See? This is one repeat and now you start from your wrong side again. You start from your row one from here. So now you repeat these 12 rows. Your row one, two, row 12. Start from your row one. Row one, two, row 12 over and over again until you reach your design length. See? And after your few repeats, your pattern looks like this. So please give it a thumbs up if you like this pattern and also subscribe to my channel. So I'll see you in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.